Welcome to the Vision Focus AeroCut Nano video training session. In this video, I will be demonstrating how your Vision Focus software makes it easy to create documents ready for your cutting on your AeroCut Nano. The AeroCut Nano comes with 12 preloaded layouts for various document and paper sizes. Vision Focus allows you to create a print ready PDF that lays out your artwork to meet the exact AeroCut Nano template layout specifications. With Vision Focus, you can begin printing and cutting your artwork with little or no manual effort at all. Let's get started. When you open your Vision Focus, you will see the welcome menu, which will allow you to open an existing job or create a new job from the template wizard. The template wizard is a great place to review all of the preloaded templates available on the AeroCut Nano. For this demonstration, I will be laying out artwork for the AeroCut Nano Arch B 2x3.5 duplex template to create a two-sided business card on 12x18 Arch B sized paper. Once I have highlighted the template I'd like to work on, I can select next. On the following screen, I am asked to name my project and form files. Naming my files will help me find them again if I need to make changes to them in the future, which I can open from the welcome menu. After naming my job, the final screen allows me to review my template settings as well as add bleed to the job if necessary based on my artwork. If you are working with artwork that contains bleed, add bleed here. Vision Focus will recommend the most appropriate max bleed size based on the template you are working from. As we will see later in the training video, Vision Focus will take any size artwork and crop it to the bleed size that we indicate here. In just those few steps, I have created the exact document layout that corresponds with the preloaded AeroCut Nano template I've selected. Before I import artwork, let's take a look at the preview of this layout in the View menu. You can see the 24UP layout preview as well as a registration mark that will be included on the AeroCut Nano PDF document. Let's exit out of this preview and I'll insert my 2x3.5 business card artwork for both the front and the back side. I will do this by selecting Insert Image. For bleed documents, please ensure that you have the Crop at Page Boundary box selected. This will crop excess area from your artwork to correspond to the bleed size set when creating the template, allowing you to use any size artwork file in your template. When importing a two-page PDF for a duplex job, the software will ask if you'd like to automatically place a second page onto the back side of the form. Select yes. Now you will see that the artwork fits perfectly into the design space and the excess space of my business card has been eliminated. The same has been done for the back page image. If you do not want to have a two sided PDF, you can import a second image for the back side from the same import slash image menu. If you are working on a simplex one sided document, you do not need to complete this step. After inserting my artwork, I will create the PDF file by going to the Home tab and selecting Create PDF. This PDF is ready for printing and cutting on the AeroCut Nano.